What's up, guys? Sorg doing the uh, one-man interviews once again, and look who snuck up on us here in the booth. What is that? What are you doing? That's that's on the floor. It doesn't it, matter. Whatever it's pro wrestling. Pro wrestling. Not even pro wrestling day, but WrestleCon. It's facade with us. I don't even know what adjectives go with your name anymore. There's a whole lot, and they're mostly colorful. <laughs> Depends on where you're at and who's <laughs> booking you. Oh, that's the truth. So we're at WrestleCon. You've been working some stuff over the weekend. I know I saw you last night at Pro Wrestling Syndicate hanging out. Syndicate Wars, yes, Syndicate yes. Wars. I think you were involved in the what? The Battle Royal the night before we missed? Yes, uh, I debuted for uh, Syndicate in the Battle Royal. Knocking some people out of the, the Rumble. Got myself knocked out of the Rumble, but secured a place in everyone's heart in the process. That's a, that's a pretty big show. A lot of big names on there. Was there anybody you were excited to kind of, you know, finally seeing a person up there? Very big. There's like like Bret Hart, Vader, superstar Billy Graham. They had the Briscoes versus uh, the Rock and Roll Express. It's all kinds of madness. Just, just madness. Awesome. Now, of course, this is day one here at WrestleCon as I'm talking to you here. There's wrestling. You're probably here. The crowd and the noise behind us here. Uh, I don't even know what show's going on. Do you know? I think there are some ladies uh, play fighting in the ring. Ooh, shimmer then. Yes, they shimmer, they shine, and they glow. Hey, look, it's the world champion. Which world champion? Oh, oh, the uh, the Thirty Rock guy. Yeah, the Thirty Rock guy. That's the real one. Should we turn around? Should we be like, hey, that's yeah. that guy? It's like, oh, I think we got him. Shiki says he's the champ one. Number one. Respect him. I, I, I didn't, like, I walked by, and I'm like, oh, look, somebody's pretending to be the guy from 30 Rock. And, and it was like, oh, no, that's actually the guy. I'm like, wh wh why is he here? That's the dude. That's the dude. He's the champion. Everybody needs to recognize him as world champion. If you ask Shiki, he would tell you he's a champ one. I spent most of the day yesterday uh, next to Shiki, cutting promos on Vine uh, at his merch table, having people pay him to cut promos to advertise such things as their tattoo shop and just to make fun of them because they were carrying around world te television titles and they were world television tag team champions and he he didn't even want to disrespect people for the most part he's just like oh no i like you and they're like no no they're paying so you can make fun of them he's like oh no no i like you i like you and then someone walks by he's like shiki you're number one he's like i respect you i respect you he stands up gets all crazy for no reason shiki's the man Team Shiki. That's awesome. All right, you've been bouncing around uh, WrestleCon here. A lot of wrestling fans. And there's Nikki Valentino. Hey, he's a, this is your your uh, introduction to the Wrestling Mayhem show. Welcome. Nikki Valentino, let's see those Zubaz. Yeah, yeah, check out these pants, guys. Hold on, let me get around here. There you go. No more vacation. What are you, you're vacationing, right? Vacation. Does that mean I can't interview about pro wrestling? No. Ask my girlfriend. Honey, come here and ask. Hey, you talk about pro wrestling. Oh. The people demand her, but she gives them none. And today, that's what I'm going to do. Nikki Valentino, ladies and gentlemen, there. Uh, we should know better than give him the microphone, really. Come on. Look at these pants now. These are, these are the real deal. These are the real deal. Flashy electric salmon. Electric salmon. Can you even deal with that? Yeah, Ninja Turtles, Turtle Power. Mike Sword has the same... Dang shirt! I did wear the same shirt last night. It's it's amazing. My it's mother amazing. My, my mother gave it for green. It's all oversprayed like brick walls, ninjas, whatever, dude. It was a birthday present from my mother. Oh, I love your mom. <laughs> I'm sending the I'm sending this one to my mom now. I miss the work. Now I'm not. All right. So oh. so so. What you got? What, what else you got going on here? You had Pro Wrestling Syndicate. What else is coming up for you? Oh, I I can plug all day, brother. I can plug all day. Plug uh, next, no, tomorrow we got uh, Dragon Gate USA here at WrestleCon, day number seven. Nice. Um, being a ladder fray. There's gonna be wait a fray? Oh yeah, it's a fray. There's gonna be me, the Young Bucks, AR Fox, Samurai Del Sol, Uha Nation, Christina Von Erie, and me. Because there's wait. ladders involved. Christina Von Erie? Yeah. She has to test her might against the men's. Oh, this is going to be amazing. Yeah. So then on top of that, what do we got? Next week, there's uh, IWC. There's Meadville and IWC. All kinds of crazy madness. Roddy Piper, Vader, Goldust, all that going on. I'm fighting Kid Cash in, uh, what is it, Newell the next day, uh, April 14th. 
week after that, uh, what, we got Prime up in Cleveland, and then Chalanga Mask up in Chicago, Lucha Libre. After that, 26th, fighting Christian York in Beckley, West Virginia. Next day, Remix Pro Wrestling, the Creeper Jason Gorey and Chance Prophet, the anti-heroes against me, Shane Helms and Mighty Molly, the uh, Mean Green Dream Team. And uh, I mean, I think that's enough for now. That's a lot, that's a lot. Excellent. Big things popping. So the big question, I don't think we had a chance. We had kind of a different interview with you last time with uh, Shilo, of course. So let us know, Facade, if you were a vegetable, what kind of vegetable would you be? A vegetable? I'm very particular about vegetables, and I don't really like them. I don't like the greens, although I am a green guy. Um, I'd say a potato. Potato? Very, very starchy. Very starchy. And below the ground, you're underground. Very underground, deep below in the ground, and I have eyes everywhere. But even more importantly, let's say hi to Cody Knotts, director of Pro Wrestling vs. Uh -huh. Zombies. <laughs> cameo here. I, how you doing? Good. Uh, this is the most cameoed interview ever. <laughs> so, hey, plug it. I, I'd rather I'd rather have you show board to have a one-on-one -on -one conversation. But uh, to tell us what, what do you guys do? What are you doing over there? We're promoting our film. Uh, we just released a trailer. We've had over 17,000 views in four days, so things are going well. And you want to see Facade, you want to see him do some amazing stunts. Awesome, awesome. Go check it out. I just checked out the trailer. I love it. I love it. I think it's looking great. Uh, so everybody check out that trailer at ProWrestlingVersusZombies.com. And uh, with that for Facade and everybody that, that, that appeared on this interview, holy crap, we'll see you guys back to the studio. That's a con!